This is a typical horse trailer in Africa. This one's a bit on the larger side. Most of them are a, a two horse and this one is a three. They typically have the European style hitch and braking system on them, which is hydraulic instead of electric. Here we have the most common truck over there, the Toyota Hilux or Land Cruiser. And then Ford Ranger, Range Rover, and similar size trucks are also common. Toyota hasn't really changed the body style in several years, so it makes parts easier to find and keep in stock. And there's quite a few diesel engines in them in there. Definitely load them heavier than in the States. You can see they almost are always fitted with a rack or enclosed cover on the back to carry more and to discourage uh, theft of things in the back. They normally have a pretty good sized bull bar and uh, just keeps the game off the, the bumper. And then the hooks on the side are really nice for securing loads and have been standard for many years. So those are your typical trucks and trailers that they use to haul horses. Uh, you know, for most people that have, you know, one or two horses. If you need to haul more than three or four horses, you're gonna need uh, what they call a lorry. It's a bigger truck, often with a ramp. Uh, but most barns, ranches, and horse arenas have a loading dock that you can use to load with. And so here they're using one to, uh, to load the horses. I think we had five or six in that, in, on that truck. And uh, yeah, it was really fun. Uh, most of, like I say, most of the places have a little dock or something you can pull up to load your horses and, and use that. And then this one actually has a ramp on the back that uh, if you need to, you can use it. So we'll do that here.